Hello, Collective. Welcome to Collectively Chosen. This is Kelly coming to you with your morning collective message. Thank you so much for your love and support. Your likes, shares, your subs, your comments. They are all greatly appreciated. I will be going through the comments today and replying to folks. Okay. Happy birthday to all my Jimmy Nines. Okay, we have the Eight of Cups. Okay. So, making a decision, standing your ground, walking away from a player here. Okay. Some of y'all, you may walking away from some player here. I like it. I like it. I like it. Okay. Standing on business first thing in the AM. <laughs> okay. Ooh, yes. You see something is just not moving forward. Okay. And you're tired of... I feel like you're tired of waiting. So, you're creating the change that you want. Okay, you are creating your forward movement, but something here as well is fated and destined. Okay, this is like uh, you possibly coming out of some dark phase. Yep, look, the temperance. This is your angels coming in to help balance your emotions in a situation. So something you could have felt as though you had a lot of love and compassion for, you're deciding to walk away. Some of you may walk away from this person via text message. Wait a minute. <laughs> okay, look at it. We have the um, the page of swords. So, hmm. You have somebody trying to get some sort of information here. Possibly, okay, uh, maybe why you don't... I'm, I'm hearing why you don't come out. Why you don't hang out anymore. Why you don't come out anymore. Okay, collective so Some of you all... You may be kind of like staying to yourself. All right. This is young energy. I feel like you're walking away from some sort of mature energy. Yeah, there's some sort of tower moment that's going to happen here. Ace of Wands. Ooh, Four of Pentacles. <clears throat> hmm. Let's see. What is this about? Let's see what this is about, right? Click collective. You could be saying two, two, two. There's a need to bring in balance in a situation. Definitely. Allow them to see your true feelings. Being vulnerable is the only way to allow your heart to experience true pleasure. Dare to love openly. Okay. Let's see. What else? What else do we have for the collective? Lighten up, collective. <laughs> Some of y'all said, fuck that, I'm out of here. <laughs> Some of y'all said, fuck it, I'm out of here. Lighten up and enjoy the journey. Take time to play more because even the smallest things can initiate change within you to live your life in love with love and joy. Okay, so then a little bit more lighthearted collective. One more, please. And then we have gifts. You may be surprised by someone's act of kindness. Be open to small gestures or any proposals that come your way. Embrace the gift. Okay. And at the bottom, we have love wins. No matter how long it takes, true love always wins. Cupid's love's brew is being specially made just for you to win your heart. Okay. So... I feel like you could be walking away from something because you feel like that it's pretty much like passion driven. Let's get into, I want to see why this chariot is in a reverse here. Confirmation. I want to see why this chariot is in the reverse here. Let's see. Why is the collective saying we're not going forward? <laughs> we're not going forward. Judgment in a reverse. Ah. Denial. Somebody feel like you. So you could be feeling like you made some sort of bad judgment while the moon was down and then now it's in the upright. So something had been revealed to you. 
you found out some sort of information that you wanted to know, okay? Um, there could be some sort of past person here. King of Cups, King of Pentacles, okay? And then we have the Ten of Pentacles. <clears throat> Someone who has some sort of emotions here. Emotion, stability. Somebody who loves you. This person could have their own business, be like a boss or something here. Or they could be into like finances. This is somebody who, they are the head of their household. They, they don't, you know... This is a father figure. This is someone who's supportive. They're emotionally uh, mature and available, okay? Um, somebody could be trying to get some sort of information here, okay? We have the Ten of Pentacles, the Lovers. Somebody wants to come towards you, Collective. But it looks like fate stepped in. Let's see. All right, we have the Page of Swords clarifying the Page of Swords. So somebody's collecting some sort of data, spying, gossiping, trying to hack your shit. <laughs> What's going on? Wait a minute. Trying to hack your stuff. Give me more on the Page of Swords, clarifying the Page of Swords. You want someone to be watching each other or trying to get data on one another? Okay, Ace of Cups. Somebody wants to know, are you, have you moved on to a new person? Okay. And then we have the star card here and the two of pentacles. Someone wants to know if you would juggle them with someone else as well. Somebody wants to know, are you seeing someone else? Could be a Taurus, uh, an earth water customer. Do we have earth and water somewhere? Uh... We go from Pisces to Aries. No. Hmm. This could be two people. Or this could be the same person. I don't know. Let's see. Somebody feels like something didn't move forward. And maybe somebody's heart was somewhere else or something here. Um, could be something of the same sex. Okay. Could be a page of pentacles, page of cups. Could be a same sex connection. Okay. I said page of pentacles. King of Pentacles, King of Cups. Good Lord. I mean, I keep seeing all these damn pages everywhere. Let's see. Huh. Temperance, Seven of Wands, and the Hierophant. Somebody's holding back to possibly try to hold back some sort of conflict. Somebody could be trying to protect themselves against some sort of competition here. We have Sag. Somebody that somebody's in a relationship with, could be married to. I don't know. Check it how it resonates for you. Emperor in a reverse. Somebody could be going through a divorce. I am getting that. Or someone here. Okay. Three of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles. Alright. Uh. Yeah, see, that's why I said somebody's let's say I felt immature energy. Somebody could be a poor decision maker here. Six of Wands, Four of Pentacles. Somebody wants some sort of a win, some sort of victory here. Give me the Ace of Pentacles. I mean, that's the Ace of Pentacles. Ace of Cups and the Chariot. Ace of Cups and the Chariot. Queen of Wands, Eight of Wands. So you can expect some sort of communication, but you may come off kind of defensive and just walk away. Like you may take offense or took offense to something. I don't know if this is past, present, or if this is a future prediction. You take it how it resonates for you or your timeline. But um, somebody's going to try to reach out, but they you may come off kind of defensive. Okay, so somebody needs you to possibly let your guard down. 
But I feel like you feel like if you let your guard down, then that's when that tower is going to come in. Confirmation. Look at that. And then we have here, the tower is already out here. So, and then we have the tower out here again. So, please give me the tower, five of swords. Okay. So, somebody could be feeling like, uh... okay, somebody feels like somebody here is playing games. And so, somebody is taking a pause. Yeah, taking a pause for the cause. Okay. But somebody wants to make a, a love offer and they want to come in with some sort of quick communication or um, this person could possibly be a bit impulsive. All right, somebody wants you to let your guard down with them though. But I don't know, it's a trust issue here. Six of Swords, the Sun. And the Nine of Pentacles. Nine of Wands. Aries, Scorpio energy, and the Queen of Cups. Okay. Nine of Wands. Okay. So somebody's protecting their heart here, is how they look at it. <clears throat> is what I'm seeing. Like somebody feels like they're protecting their heart. You're protecting your heart. Someone in here doesn't want to get hurt. Does not want to get hurt anymore. Five of Swords. Tower. Five of Swords. Tower. Five of Swords. Tower. Five of Swords. Okay. Take it slow. Some shadow work is being done. Okay. So somebody's working possibly on lowering their guard, being more vulnerable, opening up. Yeah, spice it up, change it up. Something is coming in long term and I feel like it's going to shock the hell out of you. Like I say, for some of you, it could just start off real passionate and they may be something that scares you. All right. Look, then I say final breakup, divorce. Somebody is, uh, somebody's devastated here. Somebody could be like a hot mess. So. Chariot reverse. Why is the chariot reverse? Oh, okay. Good lord. Chariot reverse. Alright. Anxiety. Aries Leo Sag. Okay. Aries Leo Sag. Somebody is very anxious on something not moving forward. Somebody wants to compromise. Somebody's watching someone on the net. What did I say? All right. Um, Ace of Cups. Somebody wants a new beginning. Someone wants to take a leap of faith. Okay. Someone regrets not taking a leap of faith. All right. Mm -hmm. Five of Cups of Fools. Okay, someone could have been having issues with finances. There could have been issues with infidelity. This person, you could feel like this person was an imposter. All right, you could have even felt like this person has some sort of mental health or something of that nature. We have divine masculine. All right, you could have felt like this person had a lot of drama and chaos. Or they do have a lot of drama and chaos surrounding a union. So this may be why spirit stepped in. Because you know the chariot is major arcana. So that's like spirit stepping in. So it's like that's why spirit stepped in and put a halt to whatever this is. Because there's someone. Someone needs to walk away from something before they could even think about coming towards you. Something would have to be final. Okay. Yeah. Grief and sadness. So someone is upset or, you know, grieving the fact that you are not talking or speaking all right children could be involved we have take a risk going out and yeah trust issues but somebody's going to make some sort of a gesture here Mm. 
Why is the devil here? Seven of Swords. Why is the devil in the Seven of Swords? Five of Wands. Five of Wands. Somebody could be obsessed with money and finances here. Empress World. Yeah. This, okay. This person is closing out some sort of cycle. There's an empress here, a masculine. There's a cycle closing out. All right, you and this person, uh, somebody could be of a different background as well. Love Miss Girl to the world, but we're heavy everywhere. All right, let's see. And somebody got trust issues. <laughs> Don't we all at some point? <laughs> okay, period. Don't we all at some point? have some trust issues too. What advice do you have for the collective for this situation? How should the collective approach this situation? Okay. Alright. Stick to your beliefs. Uh, I gotta hide this. Stick to your beliefs. As well as just keep faith and hope in the situation here. All right, there's a Taurus and oh, okay. Yeah, Taurus, Aquarius, Two of Cups, and the Ten of Swords. And then the Empress and the Nine of Swords. Give me one of one, brother. Perfect. You see something at face value with this Taurus, the Star card, Ace of Pentacles. Okay. Four cups in reverse. Ooh. All right. So these energies are feeling like you don't care. Okay. Uh, one I feel like is a high vibrational match and the other one I feel like is someone who taps into your shadow side. They're more so karmic here. Alright. I'm feeling like if you're dealing with a Taurus, what you see is what you get with this, um, with this star card. Some of you, it could be a past person. Some of you are trying to block out any past situations. Uh, whoever this Aquarian energy is, this is someone you have no more emotional feeling, okay, about this situation or this person is what I'm seeing here. And that's the truth. Okay, so you have no more emotion towards that person or that situation like at all. You're cutting that person out. Well, you've already cut that person out. Page of Pentacles. And this person, okay, and okay. So somebody, uh, this Taurus here, somebody wants to make a, amends here. Make amends, some sort of a, a gesture, offer. That's where that gift comes from, okay? So your advice is to see one for what exactly what it is, which is what I see. 
that, that's how you're viewing whoever this uh, Taurus is. You're sticking to your beliefs in the situation. Um, if you're dealing with a Taurus, it don't have to be a Taurus, okay? Um, somebody could have Taurus placement somewhere if they're not a full-blown Taurus. Let's get some golden hour messages. You've inspired me to be a better person. I find you hard to read. I can't tell what you're feeling right now. There's something else I've been dealing with. I know I crossed the line. I reread our old messages and think about how I could have said, what I could have said differently. I'm sorry for the way I treated you. I want to apologize for my actions. All right, and we're going to leave that there. We have here, I'm watching to see your next move. I heard rumors about you, but I'm not sure it was true. I felt like I couldn't pursue my goals in a relationship. Please wait for me. I'm coming back. I don't know where they get the stuff. Then somebody gonna be waiting on them, child. We're not doing it. Callum Collective. We're not doing it. We're not gonna take it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, we ain't gonna take it. Anymore. And somebody I feel like is definitely gonna be working on their finances here. It's time for me to heal now. Interference and external parties intruding on this relationship. Everything will unfold in divine timing. This person is unable to give you all you deserve. Past life love. Okay, shell. Let's that there. Your soul remembers this intense connection. All right, give me this interference. What is this external party? What or who is this external party? A king of wands, okay? Could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag. Emperor, Aries, strong Aries energy, five of wands. Somebody who wants to set up obstacles and issues. Somebody's ego is hurt, okay? Um, somebody that wants to compete with whoever this king of pentacles may be. Interesting. There's an Aries that's fighting to block something here. Two of Wands. Somebody's making some sort of plans to come towards you, Ace of Swords. Somebody is making some sort of plan to come towards you. Somebody feels as though you are um, <clears throat> I feel like somebody feels as though you kind of dethroned them. Yeah. They feel like you dethroned them. Somebody wants makeup sex. They need you to put your guard down, okay? Lover. Could be a Gemini. <laughs> Somebody wants makeup sex. Okay, look at that. And who's right behind it? The King of Wands. Mm-hmm. This person can't give you what they want. They don't want a commitment or a relationship. They just want to have passionate love making. That's what I see. 242466. You could be seeing that angel number. You could be seeing that angel number. Let's see what else. What do you want to do next? Alright, give me one. Signs. You are putting together pieces of the puzzle from signs you are getting. 
pay attention to the coincidences you experience so nothing is coincidence gifts you are uncovering new talents that will land you new work in a better position you can get more money with the deal as well so there's going to be some gift or some some offer coming towards you i say go for it collective go for it go for it go for it go for it circus in town drama okay an unpredictable situation and we have closed off and we have guarded collective hearts heartbreaker all right many love interests okay not ready to settle down all right we have unfoldment rocking horse and decision like a consistency on and off okay so you could be closed off to somebody because they're not consistent okay and that's what i think this person needs to see all right is that they are the reason for the um, for the demise of the connection okay a lot of you all you started to read between the lines okay paid attention to what was going on so you went on and you cleared out cut it off cut them off okay that's so you said honey look you need whoever this is to realize they are the reason yep yeah, look tempting offers desires okay weaknesses seduction oh somebody is temptation for you oh interesting interesting okay so you can feel like somebody here is a manipulator they're a collector of hearts they just want to um like like draw people in just to cut them off like that type of thing uh, so you say honey you're the reason you are the reason you were cut off <laughs> Luke say, look, collective say, absolutely, don't try to put it on me. You are the reason for why you got cut off. Okay. Um, let's see. Got three minutes. I can cut it off at 30. Miracles really do happen. Expect sudden growth and positive movement in all areas of your life. These miracles will bring you much joy and happiness. Your spirit guides are working very hard to lead you on the right path. Spirit is advising you to pay attention. All right. Spirit says you're the magician. Whatever it is you wish to have in this lifetime, you must develop the willpower to make it happen and make it yours. Spirit is encouraging you to keep going. Okay, life has its lessons, but don't let it discourage you. Whenever life seems not to go as you expect it, don't count it as a fail. Remember that spirit is guiding you through it all. And you are attracting true love. You have done the work of self-love and emotional healing. By loving yourself the way that you do, those who come to you will reciprocate that same energy to you. Spirit says focus on your finances at this time. Slow down with spending and develop a habit of saving or at least start to invest your money and assets that will bring you financial stability and wealth. So that's what I have for you, my lovely collective. I hope these messages help you in some way, shape, or form. Um, please leave comments and feedback. It's greatly appreciated. And I will see you guys and gals in the next reading. Peace.